This is number 11 of our tenograms. It's something to do with space. I feel like maybe it's a rocket. I'm not sure which way it's supposed to go, but the writing, smart play, is facing up. So I think this is the direction it's supposed to go. And they've given me no lines to help me, so I'm going to have to think. I definitely need two triangles here and a semicircle there and probably a big semicircle there. So let's start with that because that's the easy stuff. Always start with what's really obvious to you. And what's obvious to me might not be what's obvious to you. Because people see things in different ways, our brains work in different ways. Okay. And another triangle. Oh, now that I put the semicircle here, I can see a triangle needs to go there. So let's find one. Where's my other triangle? Can you see it? Because I cannot. There it is. <laughs> it was hiding from me. Okay. Now I have these shapes. Maybe the diamonds will fit there, but then I also kind of want to maybe put squares here. Maybe these triangles will fit there. So I'm going to have to play a bit. See, these triangles don't fit there, so that's not an option. Diamonds would maybe fit there. One there. And one there. Uh, okay. And then I would put another triangle here, but I'm missing one. We've established this already, so I'm going to put an imaginary triangle there. And then I can see for sure that I can fit two squares in here. Okay, and that would be my puzzle complete, but I'm missing a triangle. And I'm not really sure what it is. I think it's like a rocket ship. 